That's impossible. Hey, girl. So they didn't even know. You look just like your mother. Oh, of course. Yeah. We're always the villains. <laughs> Power has not been unleashed. Yeah. We made a terrible mistake. Really? <laughs> the doomsday clock might be about out of time. Is he really trying to do that to those dinosaurs? <laughs> oh! God, no, like that's just. <laughs> if our world's gonna survive, what matters is what we do now. I could use your expertise. You coming or what? A baby raptor? I made a promise we would bring her home. You made a promise to a dinosaur. <laughs> yeah. What? To a dinosaur. Oh, okay. He's doing that again. Everybody hold on to somebody. Hold on to your butts. Right. <laughs> that can't be right. Whoa. Oh no. What is that? Biggest carnivore the world has ever seen. Run! See? Not so bad. <laughs> <laughs> what? How big is this dinosaur? Okay. Look, I'll, I'll give Jurassic Park this, or just the Jurassic Park franchise this. They've done the best job of any franchise, like I think Transformers, I think, not Star Wars, but I think, well, there's a comparison with Star Wars too, but uh, Transformers, what other like uh, franchises have like, you know, the main draw and then you've got these human characters. I can't, for some reason I'm drawing a blank here. Let me know in the comments below, but I think Transformers, uh, but they've done a really great job with Jurassic Park, at least a franchise, where you care about the human characters just as much as you care about the dinosaurs. You wanna see the dinosaurs, yes, they've become more monsters than anything else in most cases, but uh, they do a good job where you care about both sides. You wanna see both sides. And now saying that they're bringing the original, you know, cast, into this fold, which you knew that was going to happen at some point. I feel like this is going to be Colin, is it Trevorrow? Trevorrow? However you say his name. Uh, he was supposed to do uh, the third uh, uh, Star Wars movie, uh, Rise of Skywalker, which I think it might have been called something different at that time. I don't know. He was supposed to do that. I feel like this is his way of being like, all right, y'all, y'all kick me off of that one. Look what I do with Jurassic Park. The first one was good, Jurassic World at least. Um, Fallen Kingdom was okay. I didn't really care for that one. You guys know that. But this one, he's bringing the old cast with the new cast. And I feel like this is kind of his way of like, you know, I don't know, showing Lucasfilm and, and Disney what he would have done over there, which if you've seen some of the concept art, it would have been dope, I think. I think he would have done a good job. It would have been much better than what we got from J.J. Abrams. That's my personal opinion. But I'm looking forward to this. This looks dope. A lot of different things happening here. Blue had a baby. Uh, they're, <laughs> which they're, I know they're gonna talk a little more about that. Uh, is somebody gonna die? I hope, I don't really want any of the original people to die. I hope that doesn't happen. Uh, you gotta keep Ian Malcolm in there. Jeff Goldblum, you gotta keep him, come on. Um, they didn't really, they kind of allude to it a little bit, like somebody's gonna be in danger. Uh, maybe Owen, who knows? But we don't have a long time to wait. June, June 10th, that, that, that's right around the corner, really. It's funny that they keep saying we made a mistake. Oh, we should have done this. You've had six movies at this point <laughs> to realize you've made a mistake. This franchise, they've, they've done some good things here overall, but like, you know, you, you see certain things that kind of revisit themselves over and over again. This was a mistake. We shouldn't have done this. Uh, we've, we've heard it over and over. But overall, I am excited. I'm looking forward to this one. My kids are looking forward to this one. We're going to go see this uh, on the big screen for sure. But let me know your thoughts in the comments. Uh, Jurassic Park Dominion, what do you think? Uh, any theories that you might have? I don't have much. I'm just hoping that Colin really shows out and shows what he what he can do, you know, with a big franchise. He would have done a really good job on Rise of Skywalker, I think, for Star Wars. I think he would have. Uh, he's, done, he's done a good job, at least with the first movie on this one. I think this one's going to be awesome as well. Cool to see what they showed in this one, though. The one, the one guy on the little scooter, he gets <laughs> caught up. Did he even see them? <laughs> They're right there. It's, it's, it's going to be cool to see all the all the craziness that happens and all the globe trotting that happens too. It looks like they're gonna go to a lot of different locations. Uh, and you'll, we'll see dinosaurs in different locales. That's pretty awesome. Something we've always wanted to see, at least for me, I've always 
want to see since the Lost World Jurassic Park. Again, in the comments, let me know your thoughts on this one. Also, again, remind me, what are some other franchises that have the main draw, which are, you know, more or less either CGI characters or, or something, and the humans are more side characters and they're not done very well. I think Jurassic Park does a really good job with that, with kind of balancing the two and you care about everybody. Members, subscribers, watchers, thanks so much for supporting the channel. However you support, it's really awesome. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button down below and hit that notification bell. Also, everybody, hit the like button. Helps out the channel in a big way. I really, really appreciate it. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for checking out this new trailer. I'm excited for this. Are you getting your tickets now? Uh, <laughs> uh, otherwise, I'll see you guys on the next video and I hope you have yourselves a great rest of the day. Take care.